Welcome to MonroeMotors.com. Here we have a 2022 Chevrolet Corvette convertible Z51 2LT in torch red on black and adrenaline red leather interior with the carbon flash painted roof uh, and painted nansels. So awesome looking machine. And we'll just shift around the back here. We'll have a look at the uh, trunk area. Uh, so nice size trunk here on the Corvette. Uh, it is designed as per GM to hold two sets of uh, golf clubs, probably not your touring bags, but definitely your carry bags will fit in there. Um, we'll go ahead, we'll close the trunk lid uh, and it does have soft close. So it simply closed itself there. I'll just step to the back. It's got the nice Z51 style carbon flash metallic spoiler. We've got the carbon flash badges uh, and lettering there as well. We've got the MPP uh, performance exhaust. So there's two ports on this side and two ports over here on this side. There is dampers on them that electronically open and close based on your setting to make that exhaust louder or quieter. Uh, there's also uh, rear cross traffic alert sensors here. So there's one there, one over here, one here and one on the vent here as well. Now, as you can see, the paint is in really, really good shape. It's just sparkling there. We've got the nice LED tail lights as well and the carbon flash lower portion of the bumper. I love the design of the lower portion of the bumper. Very neat looking. And uh, we'll just shift around this side here. We'll have a look at the rear wheel. So there it is. It's got the nice carbon flash wheels. We've got painted rotors, painted calipers in red uh, and nice Michelin tires. Everything is neat and tidy in there as you can see. And uh, we'll just shift up to the passenger side here. So over the passenger door, we've got the nice red baseball stitching, uh, the red accenting here on the door. We've got the Bose Performance Series stereo, which is a 14 speaker stereo. On the passenger side, you do get memory for the passenger seat. So two users as well as a programmable exit button. Down below, we've got our electronic door release, electronic locks and our power window switch. Here's the kick plate on the passenger side. I'll just zoom on that so you can see the condition. Looks good. Um, yeah, really in good good shape. One little minor, it's not even a scuff. Like, I don't know if you can see that there in the light. Very, very minor, but uh, overall that looks fantastic. Um, here's your power seat, power four, aft, up, down, power recline, lumbar and side bolster adjustments. Uh, you've got the nice carpets with the red baseball stitching around them. And I'll just go ahead and scan up the uh, seat here. It's in really good shape and we've got the nice carbon flat or excuse me carbon fiber inlays these are the gt2 seats it's got the carbon um the corvette logo embossed into the headrest and again that nice baseball stitching looks fantastic so as we get in just have a look in the door frame nice and tidy let's get in and uh, check the glove box on this one um so we do have books that's great uh on the dash again nice baseball stitching here and here uh the two-tone dash design Fantastic. And let's hop out and close this side up. So this one does have the carbon flash uh, mirror um, arms as well as mirror caps. And uh, with the 2LT, we do have blind spot monitor. Not sure if you can see that there. Um, but uh, anyhow, there is a symbol just in the mirror right there uh, that will light up when someone's in your blind spot. So that's fantastic. Uh, we also have the carbon flash metallic boomerangs and we'll just step to the back of the vehicle and I'll scan up this side of the car so you can see the condition. Really, really nice looking car. And uh, here you are at the front. So uh, again, nice carbon flash wheels with the uh, nice metallic ring around the outside. We've got the painted rotors, painted calipers and nice Michelin tires on there. Um, we'll move around the front. Normally we talk about the motor in the front, but the uh, motor is actually underneath the middle section there under the convertible top. So I will just speak about that. It is a V8 6.2 liter motor, uh, 495 horsepower, uh, paired to the eight speed dual clutch automatic transmission. Uh, so fantastic machine moves really well. Um, and, uh, here we are now at the front. So we'll just have a look here. You got your washer fluid top up. Uh, we've got uh, trunk emergency release as well as a 12 volt socket. We've got the front license plate cover there as well. And as you can see, everything is neat and tidy under there. So we'll go ahead, we'll close the uh, front lid here. And I'll just step to the back so you can see. Uh, so there it is. It's got the nice black housing, LED projector headlights, LED daytime running lights. Uh, we've got um, the front curb view camera. So there's one there and one over here on this side. Uh, in terms of condition, I'll just move around the front here so we can see. I'll take a close look here, see if there's anything I need to point out for you. 
Uh, the lower chin strap appears to be in good shape. Uh, nothing I see there. And uh, we'll have a look at the hood. Uh, doesn't look like there's any anything here to point out. So that's fantastic. Uh, so we'll continue on. We'll move around this side here and I'll show you the other front wheels. So there it is, uh, nice carbon flash metallic wheels. We've got the uh, Z51 red calipers, painted rotors, and nice Michelin tires. And I'll just shift to the back here. So same thing back here, looks great. And let's move up to the driver's side. So at the driver's side, again, we've got that nice Bose Performance Series 14 speaker stereo. Uh, we've got our power memory. So uh, for your seat, steering wheel, as well as your mirrors, um, that's programmable for two users as well as an exit button. Uh, we've got our mirrors up here. So power folding mirrors, power mirrors, power windows. We've got the power convertible top and the rear window switch there as well. Power door release, uh, power locks, and then the front and rear trunk releases as well with a nice storage pocket. And I'll just show you here the kick plate. So there's a little bit of scratching here, nothing major, a little bit of scuffing from boots. Um, nothing you're not gonna get getting in and out. Um, but uh, it's hard to even see in the camera, but there is a little bit of scuffing there on that plate, very minor. Um, for our seat, we do have power fore aft, up down, power recline, lumbar and side bolster adjustments. And I will just go ahead and scan up that seat so you can see the condition. Fantastic. So as we get in, let's have a look in the door frame. Nice and tidy, looks good. And let's get in and fire this one up. There we are. So in terms of kilometers, we have 8,135. No warning lights or issues there on the dash. Uh, engine oil has just been changed. Transmission fluid is at 87%. Um, on the steering wheel here, we do have cruise control. We've got our Z performance button, which opens the ports on the exhaust there and changes the uh, view of the dash. Um, down here, we do have our favorites for the radio uh, or track change. And then on this side is volume controls. We've got our arrow keys up here, which work the dash. So that gives us all these different menus. Just go through them. We've got trip computer, performance, audio, maintenance, options, and simplify. Um, here is voice command, telephone uh, answer, telephone hang up, and heated steering wheel. Up top, you got paddle shifter plus and minus. And we do have the nice red baseball stitching with red center point on the steering wheel. Looks great. Um, over here on this side, we do have our power tilt and telescopic steering wheel. We've got our heads up display controls. So I'll just show you that. Uh, there's your heads up display. So we'll just move it up a bit and we can cycle through the different information that we can display here. Uh, so that's fantastic. And you can also change the brightness. Uh, you can also dim it right out if you prefer not to see it. Uh, but it is a really nice feature that I enjoy. Uh, over here, we've got our push button start and then here's our radio. So, um, We've got, we'll just go to the home page, audio. So you got AM, FM, Sirius XM, Bluetooth streaming, USB, auxiliary line in. Uh, if we go back here, we've got telephone controls, um, navigation, so full factory nav, and uh, Wi-Fi hotspot, users, uh, your car settings, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, um, OnStar services are available. Uh, we've got PDR. Uh, so this is your performance data recorder. So simply you put a SD card in the glove box and you can set it to drive, uh, or excuse me, record automatically while you're driving, uh, or you can use it at the track and record um, your, your lap times there as well. Um, this one down below, we do have front cameras. So we'll click that. Um, that's a single image with the two cameras paired together. Uh, reverse camera, a different vision of the reverse camera. And uh, there's your front camera separated and the single image paired together above. Um, this one also has front lift. So when I click that, you can see here it says vehicle raising and the front end of the vehicle moves up two inches. It will also remember that uh, I pressed this button in this location and next time I, I uh, approach this location, it will automatically raise the front end of the vehicle, making it easier to get in and out of driveways. This one is your mode selector. So when we twist that, uh, we get the different modes down there, sport, track, uh, we can go back here, touring, uh, my mode, uh, weather, um, or again, your Z mode. So that's all there. Uh, here's your climate control. So this is your driver's temp, driver's heated and cooled seat. And then down below we have heated and cooled seat and uh, temperature for the passenger. There's your cup holder. Here's one of the keys to show you what it looks like. Lock, unlock, front rear trunk, remote start, and remote uh, top down. 
Um, in here, we do have a center console. We've got two USBs auxiliary line in and the SD card for the navigation. This is your wireless charger for your phone and one of the speakers there. Uh, so since it's a convertible, we'll go ahead here and uh, put the top up. So I'll just uh, show you that operation here. Awesome. And uh, here's your rear view mirror camera uh, that is operational when the top is up. And then it's also a mirror, whichever you prefer. So we'll just hop out with it running now. We'll have a look and listen. Um, let's see. Great sound to it. And I'll just show you here from the front with the uh, headlights on. So you can see how nice and bright they are. Definitely easy to see at night. And we'll just move along this side of the vehicle so you can see the condition. There's that nice carbon flash metallic roof, nice deep dark tinted windows. Nice chug or rumble here to the exhaust. There we have it folks, 2022 Chevrolet Corvette convertible Z51 2LT torch red with black and red leather interior, carbon flash roof. You're available at MonroeMotors.com. Come on down and have a look at this one for yourself. Look forward to seeing you real soon.